All right, guys, look at the view from the top of the camper. Uh, I'm not up here for my health, I can tell you that right now. So we were here on Saturday, uh, stayed overnight into Sunday, and we tried to kick the air conditioner on just for a little bit of um, noise pollution, just to block out every, it wasn't loud here, but it's strange noises. So we were just blocking everything out and it came on, no air was blowing, uh, and then it just quit after two or three minutes. So I jumped on YouTube over when we got home on Sunday, I was watching some uh, YouTube videos and it said if it's been in storage for a while, which our little red has, it's it's been under cover, but it's not covered. And so it recommended, they recommended coming up here, pulling the cover off of the top of the air conditioner. And I found exactly what they thought was gonna be up here. So check this out, guys. Yeah. This is holding up my fan which is keeping me from air conditioning at night. It hasn't got that hot yet, but we're gonna clear this out and see if we can get that air conditioner pumping. <clears throat> wow, it's a big nest. It's old, you can tell it's an old nest. <laughs> yeah yeah so look look at this mess so that was um had my fan locked up for sure all right let's get a little more of this debris out of here i may i have the leaf blower in the back of the jeep i may have to go get the leaf blower and make sure all of this is cleaned up anyway it, it's we haven't we haven't done any kind of um PM on it or anything since we've had the camper. <laughs> so yeah, let's go to get that leaf blower. <clears throat> okay, back up with the leaf blower. Let's make sure all this is just cleaned out and ready to go for the season. We got it. It looks all cleaned out. I didn't have to take the fan off. Sometimes the nests are so tight in there from what I've seen on videos that you would just unscrew this screw to loosen up the, the fan, take the fan off, clean everything up real nice. But it looks like we have killed this bird nest for this time. And I um, did not tell you that um, I did kill the power just for good measure. I killed the power before I come up here. Before I screw that cover back on, let's head down, see if this thing is gonna fire up. I'm afraid we might have popped a fuse the other night trying to get it to go. So let's go try it. And we have air. Perfect. You know, the one thing I can say is to, um, to do preventative maintenance on your rooftop air conditioner. I, it was something I really never thought about because we never used the camper. But I guess that means more preventative maintenance. But listen, and I have cold air blowing. Melinda is going to sleep cool tonight. 